welcome guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, we're off to the uh, Keep It Great Show and Shine and Meet It Great, so we're going to go meet up with uh, Andrew from Clutch Kick Junkies uh, in his uh, sick built RB R33. So uh, if you're watching this right now, there's probably enough footage to make a video, but we'll see what happens. Um, yeah, we're running late. Jacko was supposed to be coming with me, but must have drank way too much last night and uh, it was a no-show. <laughs> so we're running a little bit late because we were waiting for the useless mongrel. But uh, yeah, heading up solo. We'll go meet up with Andrew and uh, yeah, cruise down to the uh, Keeper Eat Show and Shine. Should be a sick day. Beautiful weather, sunny 26 degrees. Good day for a cruise, so yeah, it should be sick. I'll uh, see you is when I get there. It's the only life I'll ever notice that wish you slowly took over mine. Maybe it's me, blood brothers have slowly died. Four days got me acting like my blower died. I'm over life, disappearing and going hard. And sit alone and replay on that older life. Be sleeping on the tunnel run. We just got to Melbourne. We are down here at the golf course with Andrew. What up? How you going, guys? Clutch kick junkies. Yeah. Uh, this is his 33. Trying to <laughs> clean it up for you guys. <laughs> Last minute detailing. No, this thing's an absolute weapon. How much power does it make? 407 kilowatts at 20 psi. Oof! Not bad for an RV. Sick. He's got a much bigger channel than mine, so you probably already follow him. But if you don't, I'll chuck it up here. So check out my videos and I'll get something of this S15 as well. Yeah. Yeah, we're just about to head off to the uh, Keep It Eat meet and greet. <laughs> yeah, a little trick. My spring's fucked in there, so I need some vibrations. Yeah. It's pop. Oof. Oof. RFB. Hell yeah, man. Oh, it's too warm. Dude, that's so hot. I've got to wrap up a lot of stuff, like the dump pipe there, i still got to do the exhaust wrap around. It's yeah. just been lazy, man. And I hate playing with exhaust wrap, it just... I hate it. <laughs> it stings your fingers and shit. I had it on the um, S14 manifold, had it for like six months or something, and then just ripped it off. As soon as, whenever I was working on the car, just getting itchy and yeah, stuff, it's like, man. nah, got rid of it all, cleaned it all away, and then... I feel you, man. There's a spot right there where I've got exhaust wrapped. So oh, like, yeah. Six boots just to protect the power steering lines. Yeah. When I was moving shit there, like the vacuum lines and that, yeah, as you were saying, gets in your hands. Yeah. It just fucking irritates me. Up the hyper gear turbo. What up, Tao? <laughs> Ew! It looks, it's got the same front housing as mine. Is there a 6 3 rear here. housing as well? Uh, 8 3. Eight oh, 8 2. Oh, wait. Six. Point six three. Either 0.63 or 0.83, I can't remember now. So it was ages it looked, ago. Mm, it looks like it could be a 6.3, I don't know. It might be bigger than mine. It's very similar turbo to mine though. But I think you've got it a bigger a six, internal six. core and you got the yeah. T51 armor, yeah. which sounds insane. It sounds so good at night time. Like yeah. when there's no traffic around, you're driving next to me, you can hear it whistle pretty loud. It's yeah, definitely have to get some shots of this thing spooling up. Sounds oh, yeah. sick. Oh. Did you blast your plenum or something? No, it's pretty dirty because I always lean on it when I work on it's my car. It's plain as, but... Oh, when I rebuilt it, I bought this uh, silver paint. That's oh, like, yeah, it looked yeah. like OEM. Yeah. Like brand new OEM. Played yeah, it yeah. all up, sprayed it. It looked the best when it was first done. Because yeah. I'm a prick, I keep fucking putting my hands here and just keep working on my shit. This shit's getting <laughs> dirty, man.
fresh line up of cars. We're going to have a bit of a walk around. We had Andrew parked up here. We got Cam Martin's drift car. This thing's sick. Couple of four doors. One, two, three, four. S15 gang. So nice. Rods in the VT. Baby seats. This thing shot a rod out the block, hence the uh, no engine. Fat four door. average job of filming once again I'm pretty good at that but uh, if there's enough footage to make a video then I will I'll get some shots off Andrew the S15 cruising which you would have already seen anyway if you're watching this but uh, yeah everyone's going to the pub at 7 uh, Andrew's going home because he's been a little girl but I'll probably kick it for a little bit and then go to the pub have a couple and then cruise back to Geelong but yeah it's been a sick day sick cars sick people not bad, good weather. All right, we are back from that Keep It Reap meetup. I uh, didn't do an outro, so I'm filming one now, but yeah, a little bit of a different video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Smash the like button if you did. Subscribe if you're not already. Uh, next video is more than likely going to be me building and reassembling the SR for the S14. I just dropped the head off yesterday at the machine shop to get them to remove the valve guides, put new valve guides in and machine them to suit. I was trying to do it myself, but 
not going to happen. So they're going to do that. They're going to give the deck, uh, the head a light deck as well. This little skim to make sure she's all straight, and then whack her back together and back in the car. Got a big list of parts either here and on their way, so she's going to be getting a few upgrades. It's going to be sick. So keen. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.